So you're ready to start on the cozy cooler for the can. Now, how do you do this? There's a few different ways to do it. The way I did this, and the first way I thought of, we're gonna start with the can. I wanna make a copy of this. So Shift D, left click. You can also copy and paste here. So we're gonna take can two, and I'm gonna rename it. We'll just call it cooler. And I'm gonna hide the can. So now we just have the cooler. We'll go into edit mode here. Now I don't want the top of this right here. And I basically want everything else. So a few ways to do this. I'll go in with base select. Okay, and I'm gonna go with control plus to select more right there. Now, if you don't have that control plus set up, uh, you can just carefully uh, select these right here. It might be easier to do it with uh, x-ray mode turned on to select through things. Uh, the other way you could do it is you could use some loop, uh, loop select, control shift. There we go. So some loop select, uh, delete this. Uh, so there's a lot of ways to do it. So when I delete that, I'm gonna go to uh, edges. Actually, I think I wanna get one less than this, control minus. Now I'm gonna go edges and faces. There we go. So I have a little bit of edges sticking up at the end. Those are easy to take care of. Delete only edges and faces. There we go. So this is a good start right here. This is in fact the exact dimensions of the can. It's a copy of the can. So from here, you probably wanna take the top and shrink it down a little bit. Now, we're gonna go into modifiers here and I like to do modifiers in edit mode. And if you do a solidify, it's gonna choose some really small dimensions. All right, so. The solidify modifier is going the wrong way. So we can just offset it the other direction. As to how thick it should be, that's up to you. How cold do you want your drink? This is probably ridiculous, uh, but whatever you think looks reasonable is fine. You're gonna have a bit of work to do at the bottom. So this is what solidify is gonna give you. Even if you did even thickness, it's not really gonna be too helpful. If you do turn on the X-ray, the inside of it is gonna be just fine. It's the outside that we need to work on. All right, so you have quite a bit of work to do to get the outside to look like this. So you do need a hole in the middle and I'll show you what the inside top view is. So it has the exact shape of the can here, the bottom of the can. This is far more intricate than most uh, cozy coolers are. Most of them are just flat at the bottom, but you're going to use the outline of the can at the bottom. But when it sits on a table, you need an actual flat surface and you do need a cut out in the middle. As to how big the cutout is, it's up to you. Don't make it too big, but you know something reasonable like that will be just fine. So that's how I made my uh, cozy cooler.